bare hands? Is the sword equipped? Oh, I have to, like, equip the sword, and then he'll be able to, like, cut the bar. How's the sword gonna- what are, what, are, what are these bars made of that this sword is gonna be able to break it? Force the cell door open with the long sword. Okay. Gotta remember, I'm playing a PlayStation 1 game. They make you do a lot of ridiculous stuff. Oh, that looks like Mint right there. I think Mint is like a cleric healing girl with blonde, long blonde hair. If I remember her from the cameo battle correctly. Hi! Are you alright? Have you been hurt? Don't be afraid, I've come to help you. My name is Chris Alvain, what's yours? I am Mint. Yep, it's her, let's go. Mint Adande. Adnad. Adnaid? I probably butchered that like eight different times, dude. Thank you very much for saving me, Mr. Alvane. Well, they captured me too. I broke out of my cell just a few moments ago. We should escape from this place together. Uh, we can't stay here any longer. They're gonna find us. Please wait. I beg you, we must save my mother before we go. Ah! Ah! Ah, this is really awkward. Ooh, ah. Uh. Well, I like, oh man. This is, man. She should be in one of the cells on the other side. Ooh. Uh. I gotta go. Huh? Yeah, she's a uh, whoo. I, I don't, th I think that she's a little busy. That's where I was locked up, but I didn't see anyone else on my way out. We've got no more time. Come on, hurry. But I'm sure I heard my mother's voice. She told me to be strong. I'm certain it was mother. It's probably a figment of your imagination. Forgive me, Mint, but we can't dawdle anymore. We'll be caught if we debate this any longer. I understand. Hey, I can change your name after you told me your name. Uh, I'm like 99.9% .9 certain your name is supposed to be Mint, so. Like, that is correct. What's going on over here, huh? I think this connects to the waterway. Do we have any way of getting past these bars? Oh, baby, is it time for the patented JRPG sewer level already? I mean, I have a sword. An ordinary sword is too light to break the bars. Maybe there's something heavier I can use to smash them with. Oh, do I have to equip the stupid axe? I equip the battle axe. Oh, dang it, I keep hitting triangle to try and go back. X being the back button is making me want to die. Yeah! There we go. The shaft of the axe splintered from the impact. The remains have been discarded. Now he can get out of here. Well done, Mr. Alvane. Rearmed himself with the longsword. Why do you not do that when you get new items? Just put it on instead of me being like, oh, I gotta go and equip the exact right item for this. Mink can support Cress in battle with her clerical arts. She will use them automatically, but if you need her to use a specific one right away, select it manually from the arts menu. If there are any arts you don't want her to use, you can restrict her from using them. While in the arts menu, move the cursor to the art and press square to restrict or allow their usage. Allowed arts will be displayed with a light color, while restricted ones are with a dark color. Cool, cool. Let's go look at our arts right now. Uh, first aid. I'm gonna allow that one. Eh. Oh, no, wait, no, it's, it, think, it thinks I'm trying to use first aid. It's because I'm hitting circle instead of X because I'm trying to go back with circle. But you have to go back with X in this game, which still makes me want to die inside. Uh, That's, uh, that's not spooky at all. What's this glowing symbol thing? It is a memory glyph. So, what's it do? If you stand upon it, the things you've experienced will remain as residual memories. Oh, it's a safe spot. <laughs> As soon as she was like, save your memories or whatever, I was like, oh, it's, this is how you save in this game, unless you're on a world map. Memory glyphs are often found near boss battles or important events, so be sure to watch for them. Will do. Channeling ring, which I think lets you... I think Chad said you have to have a channeling ring equipped to let a second player play as... A, like, you have to equip it to mint for another player to play, which is insane, but funny. Yeah, it's time to chronicle my deeds. Exactly. Oh, here we go. What kind of controller do you use? DualShock 4. When I'm on PC. It's bats! 
Do I miss my knight sword? Give me back my knight sword. Yeah, get him. Get him, Mint. Yo, Mint's killing it over there. Go, Mint. Go. Screw you and your sonic wave attack. Hey, check this out. Ow. Alright, that swallow dance didn't do as well as I was hoping it would. Much better. Oh, baby. Now we're talking. Get stunned. Alright, that went way better. Mint, you have so little HP compared to me. Yatta. When we get back to the overworld, I'm going to try and get the skits to work again. Because it seems like skits only happen in the overworld, so it's not like we're missing any while we're in here. We'll only miss them if we go to the, uh, if we go to the overworld and then continue. Giant slug. I just read a post that says the game auto maps gets to the share button for PS4 controllers. Shouldn't matter though since you remapped it. That's also what I originally had it mapped to was the share button. I was saying options earlier by mistake, but options is what I have start set to. I, uh, I put select as uh, share. So there's some other reason that it's not working, but I don't know why. Thankfully, I think that skits in early Tales of games are normally, like, they're pretty basic. Like, oh no, this is happening. So I doubt we've missed anything major, like, any, like, really good skits or character moments, hopefully. So hopefully I could just get it fixed before we get much deeper in the game. I will definitely, I will find some way to fix it. I shouldn't say that because it might be impossible. Who knows? You never know. But I'm gonna, like, I'm gonna put a lot of effort into having it fixed before next stream if I can't fix it during stream today. Yo, a slime? What is this? A JRPG? Can't touch this. Man, can you imagine, like, being born in, like, 1980-something, and then this game comes out, and you're like, this is peak gaming? I mean, this is really impressive for the times, don't get me wrong, but having grown up with, like, early 2000s games, like... The earliest games I remember playing were, like, Sly Cooper. Like, playing a Sly Cooper game and then seeing this and being like, that's crazy. Orange Gel, thank you. This game does look really good for, like, being an old PS1 game. It's got a lot of character to it. I like the... I like the work they put into this. You missed a skit where Crest says Chester is his son. Oh, well... That'll make the game all the funnier when later on, uh, Chester starts calling Cress daddy, and I'm like, kind of creepy, but okay. Boop. It's one of the first games I played back as a kid, holds a lot of memories. This looks like a game that would have been like, I can see this game being for a lot of people, like, oh, I grew up on this. It seems like a game that, like, it could be like, like, for me, the Sly Cooper games, when I had them when I was younger, I played them a ton over and over again, because they were just, like, some of the only games I had, and I loved them. So, like, I could see someone else doing the same thing with this game, like, playing it over and over again, because it was just, like, it was the game that you had on the PS1 that you were like, oh, I want to play my PS1, what am I going to do? You know, my parents aren't going to go buy me a new game every other week, so I got to replay stuff over and over again. I got to play friggin' Tales of, uh, Fantasia again. Went from this to Symphonia. I've played every Tales of since then. Nice, nice. Symphonia was my first on the PS3 uh, remaster they did. And then I went straight to Graces and Zillia. And I think I played Zillia 2, like, either right when it came out or, like, a couple of months after it came out. And then I played uh, Zesteria and Berseria as they released. And then I played Abyss. I played Vesperia Definitive when it came out. Uh, played the 3DS version of Abyss. And then, obviously, I just played Tales of Arise when it came out, which is, like, one of my favorite games of all time now. Man, Tales of Abyss was so... Or, uh, Tales of Abyss was also very good, but I meant to say Tales of Arise. So incredibly good. Yeah! Yeah, get him. Get him! I hope I get more options for fighting airborne enemies later. I feel like ale... Uh, ale? <laughs> airborne enemies are significantly more annoying. First idol. Yeah, 
Hey, easy level up. Got Arise last week. Haven't had a chance to get past the first few hours, though. Oh, I adore Arise. It is one of my favorite games I've ever played. I hope you have a good time with it. That game is fantastic. Story, characters, gameplay. They, they like, nailed it on every... Every front IMO. Music. The music in that game is phenomenal. So good. Well, this looks like some kind of a boss. Clay Demon. You naive fools thought you could escape? You won't take another step. Bet. Ooh. Boss music. I need you little guys to get out of here so that I can focus on Big Lad. Yo, Big Lad did, like, a bunch of damage. Wrong button. Wrong, wrong button repeatedly. Ow. Don't ever kick me out of my swallow dance ever again. I have 169 HP. No! No! Mint, you ruined it! I was at 169! That's a guaranteed win. Ow, that hurt. Note to self. Need to... Man, guarding that, it did 30. Oh, dear. Yo, I hope you got a lot of first aid ready to go. Knocked him down. Trying to keep him down. Alright, that bat's dead. Let's go. I need to stun lock you, sir. First aid. Thank goodness first aid heals so much. Dude, I love Swallow Dance. Getting low on TP, but it's fine. Just keep it going. Keep the stun lock alive. Alright. There's still a giant... Yeah, there's still a slug here. Go! Alright, cool, cool, cool. It's just Clay Demon, lad. Let's go. I don't need TP against you anymore. What you got? What you got? Ow! No, I'm a 69! I'm unstoppable! Help, I'm down. How do you get up? How do you get up? Whoops. Hey. Fancy seeing you here. Oh, he's dead. He only had 12 HP that whole time. Oh, yeah, that was a pretty good boss fight. Hey, new spell. Nice, nice. You retrieved your stolen weapons. Nice. Give me my better sword. No, not mint. Go back. Press. Yeah, look at how much better that is. Those stats, man. I have a technical ring? The manual battle control option. Wow, that is... That is, uh... Like, on one hand, it's kind of funny. Like, oh, hey, the way that you're able to do different game modes and uh, multiplayer is by equipping accessories. On, on the actual hand, it's like, that blows. <laughs> I didn't mean to take it off. I guess I should, like, leave it on for now. Hey, I'd like to save again now that I beat that super difficult boss. I think was doing 100 damage. I need some new armor, man. Or more levels. Time to get grinding. Oh, wait, there's a thing over there I missed. I want that. It was the first time they did that. They put manual as an option later on. Oh, is this like the only Tales of game where they make it like that? I can imagine... I can imagine them being like, oh, this is a neat idea. And then literally, like, four people play the game and are like, hey, this blows. And they're like, yeah, we'll change it. We'll stop doing that. Ooh, a rapier. Is that better than my Night Saber? One more thrust for the cost of 13 slash. Insanely not worth. No thank you, sir. I wonder if it makes you combo differently, though. Maybe. It's literally one slug. Yeah. I will avenge my slug brothers! And now you're gonna get, you're gonna get destroyed. Later, sucker. Oh, thank goodness that first aid still went through. Oh my goodness, we're in the forest! We should be far enough to avoid being caught. So, uh, about, about your dead mother. Behind you, Mint! Ah! Mr. Alvain, 
How how old are you in relation to me? I don't like you calling me Mister. I'm like 16, right? <laughs> I shouldn't have lowered my guard. Oh well, killed by a slime. What a way to go. Mr. Alvain, please hang in there. I just imagine, like, all the other Tales of protagonists, like, seeing the protagonist of the first game getting downed by a freaking slime spewing gunk at him. Like, of all the things to go down to. Mr. Alvain! Oh no, are they after us? We have to get away. Oh my goodness, Mint is carrying me on her back! She's been lifted! Mint swole, confirmed. You know this chick hasn't been skipping leg day. Mom. Dad. Are you alright? I'm a little nervous being in a bed again. The last time I was in a bed, I was woken up by being poked with a spear. Where am I? You're in my residence. My name is Trinissus D. Morrison. I was poisoned. Did you save me, sir? Well, something like that. Thank you very much. Your name is Cress, correct? That's what I heard from your buddy, at least. And the young lady told me of your howling escape prior to arriving here. That's about it. Just wanted to fill you in on the circumstances. Gotta let the player know what's happening. Ah, oh, you have awakened, Mr. Alvain. I'm so glad. Ah, oh, yes. Remember to thank her properly. Don't be fooled by her delicate frame. She was carrying you to safety when I found you. Mr. Morrison, I, uh... I really do appreciate it, Mint. It's... I... Oh, I, I assume that's supposed to look like she's blushing, but it actually looks like she's choking to death and her face is turning purple. Uh, anyway, Mr. Alvain, you should eat this. It'll help you feel better. I do like eating. Wow, this tastes great. I could eat it every day. Could you please teach me the recipe? I learned how to make quiche. Also, you should hold on to this. Oh, the monster book. My favorite book. Wow, Mr. Morrison certainly has an interesting collection, doesn't he? I'm sure it will be helpful. Haha, -ha, before you take a look at that book, why don't you go out and get some fresh air to help you wake up? Ah, oh, that sounds good. Yo, where are we? Like, are there not people nearby that are gonna try and arrest us or something? Or kill us? I love going out just to take in the fresh, sweet air. I find it positively invigorating. Mr. Alvain, are you feeling better? Yeah, sorry to make you worry. I feel good as new. You were out for so long, thank goodness. Oh, uh, by the way, may I help you with something? Well, it's just I've noticed you're always very formal when referring to me. Ah, oh, does it make you uncomfortable? I'm sorry. No, it's not that. I just think it's a little excessive. Please just call me Cress. Yeah, stop calling me Mr. Oh, is this the mansion that I was trying to come to earlier? Like, way down south? It totally is! I knew it. Oh, well. Whoa! About time you woke up, man. Oh, Chester, thanks for almost killing me! Chester, you're here too? I believe I mentioned that your buddy already told me your name. Or did you not catch that? I actually did catch that, and I was about to say, like, wait, buddy, do you mean Chester? But then I figured you were just talking about Mint. But then you also called Mint Young Lady. I should have mentioned something. Mr. Morrison showed up at the village shortly after you left. You must have just missed him. Yeah, I went to his house. Thanks to him, we were able to give the villagers proper burials faster than I thought. So that's what happened. But what brought you to the village, Mr. Morrison? I was on the trail of a man in black armor. If I had learned of him just a bit sooner, I might have been able to help protect everyone. But even with Miguel there, what an atrocity. They went after Maria, too. Such a shame. You know both of my parents? Yes, they were old friends of mine. Meryl is the name of this young lady's mother. I knew her as well. What are the odds? Probably better than any of you did. Mother. By the way,
away, Cress. Miguel should have had a jewel of which he took great care. Do you have any idea where it might be? He gave me something like that, a necklace containing a jewel for my birthday a couple of years back. But, okay, so a couple of years, it was your 15th birthday. You gotta be at least 17, somewhere between 17 and 21, I'm guessing. Oh, do you have it with you now? Well, you see, it was stolen from me. What did you say? Just before they threw me in a cell, a man in blank, uh, blank, in black armor yanked it from my neck. What's so special about the jewel, anyway? How could this have happened? We're losing every advantage we had. This isn't good. I must go to the mausoleum. The rest of you should wait here until I return. Hold it! Is that where the man in black armor went? We'll go with you. Please let us avenge our families. Forget it! Ah, oh, come on, man. Please, sir. As you are now, you would be nothing but a burden to me. Go grind up to level 87, then we'll talk. As if you know what we're capable of. Please give us a chance. Have you ever bested Miguel in a duel? Well, uh... Yes! Who's here to say otherwise? Miguel, is he gonna say I didn't? I apologize if I allowed you to die because of those pendants. I can never face my old friends again. So, for heaven's sake, please don't be selfish about this. I have a feeling we're gonna be selfish about this. <laughs>